the Igbo Women Assembly, IWA, has kicked against any plans to reserve grazing lands or ranches for Fulani Esme in the southeast geopolitical zone, stressing that doing so would be a tactic approval to the Esme to continue killing Igbo men and rape their wives and daughters. They said that the only one sensible route to the country's development was for Nigeria to be restructured now, adding that intimidation will not work as the people of the zone cannot be Islamized. The women who spoke in reaction to the latest killing of farmers at Nimbo in Uzo, Uwane, local government area of Enugu State on Monday, decried the audacity of the audacity the S men have in killing innocent Nigerians since President Muhammad Buhari assumed office about how many years ago. IWA made its stand known in a statement signed by its national president, Chief Mrs. Maria Uwanyunwa Oko, who also decried the extrajudicial killing of members of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOP by security agents, among other injustices meted out to the zone. Oko's statement reads in part, Not long ago, 76 people from Uguleshi in Agu local government area of Enugu State were arrested by the Nigerian army and taken to Humahia, which is another area of jurisdiction. Their offense was that they tried to defend their farm land from being destroyed by the Fulani Hesmen. It was through the intervention of the governor of Enugu State that those poor farmers were later released on bail. The extrajudicial killing of the, in of the inde independence now, uh, people of Biafra, members between November 2015 and 2016 in Port Harcourt, Abba and Odicha is condemned by the women. This unresolved, cold-blooded mother of Eastern youth could be could coupled, coupled with the provocative brigandage of Fulani in recent times may have probably emboldened the director of the director of state services. DSS to publicly lay a charge of abduction and murder of the IPOP for effects. This accusation of killing and burying of five northerners in a shallow grave, if true, is wrong and Igbo women condemns it and would want the culprit brought to early justice. If, however, the accusation is false, then it must be said as succinctly as possible that the DSS has taken a very dangerous route that will not only lay the foundation for eventual disintegration of Nigeria but ensures that a needless blood that accompanies the mayhem. The DSS intends to prop up mutual suspicion and spur ethnic hatred. Our message to the APC government is clear, short and precise. The quest to intimidate, oppress, and silence Eastern Nigeria will not succeed. The dream of conquering our people through hatred and threat of genocide will not work. We cannot be Islamized. There is only one sensible route open to Nigeria, which is to restructure the country now. Intimidation will not work, neither will force accusations. This is a time bomb waiting to explode. The group says no to grazing reserves or ranches and grazing rats in Igbo land. Any attempts to acquire, seize, or occupy ancestral lands for Fulani Esmen to facilitate the killings of her people and raping of her women and daughters will be highly resisted. On the night of April 24, 2016, while villagers were asleep, Fulani Esmen struck, killing several people and setting churches and cars ablaze. The DSS is yet to react to these heinous crimes. For how long must our people continue to suffer in the hands of Esmen? The group called on President Muhammad Buhari and the security agencies to treat the Fulani menace with the urgency it requires. We cannot continue to re tolerate these unprovoked attacks on our people. It may lead to total uncontrollable anarchy. Okay. At the end of the day now. <laughs> This whole thing has fallen on deaf ears. How many months for them to live now? Is it up to 10 months for them to live now? They are doing nothing. They are not ready to do nothing. No. They are not doing anything. It has been like that. I always remember Aisha Buhari, the wife of the president, 
is she said that if nothing will be done to all these menace and she said this two three years ago that it will continue to happen every time this thing happens i was just like oh when you know people a lot of people were really coming out that time talking about this old thing talking about this old thing and yet we are the old thing the insecurity has taken another dimension nothing has been done Buari is there feeling big that he's going to do this is good so him he has done he has done his best he has done so much he doesn't understand why nigerians are complaining he doesn't understand he doesn't understand that people will just sit down and be and not appreciate what he has done i don't i don't understand what this man is doing you know? whether he's deliberately doing it or he's being fed or he doesn't know he's being fed with uh, false information or he doesn't know what is happening either of those either of those hmm. when you want to take people land by force this is what it will result to because now they have made it a taboo now that you cannot protest if you protest oh uh, whatever whatever we hijack it for how long i jack it but you cannot arrest the situation by which these people have been doing all these things and it's happening over and over again nigeria cannot and will never be one criminal is criminal if fulani killer killed your people they have committed crime and the killers should be killed also but my question here does the does that become islamization when esn are killing innocent outside traders in olu and other parts of igbo land did we say you want to christianize the country you know if it is so you will know people are not just saying all these things people are not just making all these things up even nambekano has been saying it before Obasanjo came out and, and blew the whole thing out. There's an agenda. Okay, what about a governor autumn? Because you think people don't know what... If you don't know, if you are not part of the people or if you cannot see what is happening, that is your own cup of tea. But that is what is obtainable. People are not just making excuses. And you can see that governor autumn has been on this case for over how many months. He has been consistent that these are the plans, these are the plans. And they cannot even maybe they cannot even they can't even debunk they can't debunk it and they can't even deny it hmm. well igbo like igbos like other tribes own properties everywhere in nigeria why can't other times other tribes do business in igbo land peacefully anyone that kills should be killed be it full and igbos or yoruba because the government is not doing what it's ought to do because this is what will result to extra judicial killing because people are even coming out to protest it's even a good thing that they are protesting so that you understand what is happening so that they will not take laws into their hands but unfortunately unfortunately reverse is the case the government is doing nothing looking the other way and you expect people not to say one thing one thing but when it comes to ipop oh they will just gather people together they will just mob do them up esn oh they want to do this they have caught them with we arrested this but why is it that the manner at which they are are you want to tell me that the atrocity that a uh, esn is committing according to them full and yes men are not committing it and you have not been able to arrest them they have not been able to parade anybody called s men so what are you talking what do you expect people to think to clap for the government no one can islamize nigeria huh. no one you need to go and deal with the s men that are tormenting you there i only blame our forefathers that allowed us to be amalgamated into the niger instead of resisting the white people with their ba black magic but now so our uh, saboteurs fulanis are something else they are something else i think uh, to a very large extent they've been pushed back but they are still raising their ugly ears just to make sure that they do what they want to do nobody can tell anybody now that there's nothing like a islamization nobody nobody nobody's going to believe anybody that oh these people are not are not do, do not have any agenda 